What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we are opening up four mystery boxes from Stop, Pop, and Roll, so stick around and let's see what we get. All right guys, so like I said in the intro, today we're opening up four mystery boxes from Stop, Pop, and Roll. These are the Catch the Clown mystery boxes. They were $15 each plus shipping, and uh, we got them not too long ago. I'm pretty excited to open these up. Uh, here's the possible top hits that you could get in this mystery box. And to be completely honest, I don't really care for anything except for Freddy Funko as Pennywise. So, um, if you guys know, it's been an ongoing battle. I'll try to hunt one of those down, I'll try to find one. And I'm sure someone's gonna say, hey, Corey, why don't you just go buy it? And I'm gonna say, because that's not as much fun. You know, why, why would I go buy it when I can just keep opening mystery boxes, having fun with you guys? Come on. You guys don't like to have a good time? Jeez. Party poopers. Okay, so, oh, sweet. Put some all in sorters. So it's not so bad. One, two, three, and four. Ooh, and a uh, stop, pop, and roll mystery box. Mr. Collect It did that logo. The same guy who does a bunch of our logos. Uh, stop, pop, and roll. He's a member of the FCS, so make sure you follow him. Check him out. Uh, I'll let you guys know the number I picked on all these. Number eight right here. Um, so let's not fuck around anymore and just open these up. Yeah. Give you guys the first shot at seeing them. Here's this one. All right, this is Mitsuki Sage Mode from Boruto. I know nothing about this. I know that it's anime, and people were pretty excited about this because it is a uh, glow-in-the-dark pop, Hot Topic exclusive. Um, this thing does look pretty sick. Let's open this up. I know nothing about this show, but it's got some sort of snake situation in here. Oh. Yeah, this is pretty badass. That's what it looks like right there. Pretty cool, got some like transparent snake vibes all around it. Uh, I wish I knew more about this because then I'd probably keep this thing. But yeah, this thing's pretty sweet. I mean, I'm not gonna keep it. It's probably gonna go to one of you guys, so hit me up if you guys still need this. I know it released a few weeks back. Alrighty, box number two is box 17. All right, cool. Let's open this up. Uh, let you guys look first. What do we get here? All right, this is the a Walmart exclusive Venomized Spider-Man. So I do uh, dabble in the Venomized collection, so this actually might stick around in my collection. This seems pretty cool. I think the only person that I'd, I'd give this one up to is... Uh, Money's Funko Pops if he needs it because I know that he is a fan of not only the Venomized stuff but also Spider-Man so set that over there. Moving on to box number three. It is box number 39. These, I know there, I think there were 50 boxes in total of these all together. Let's give you guys the sneak preview. And we got from Mad Max we got the Coma Dwarf Warrior. I don't know. Another thing I know nothing about. Mad Max from Fury Ro Mad Max Fury Road. It's a Target exclusive. I mean, another pop that actually looks pretty cool. He's got like some sort of... It looks like a guitar or a gun of some sort. It looks totally like a guitar. Is this guy in Ramstein? <laughs> That's what it looks like to me. <laughs> With the fire and the guitar. <laughs> Total Ramstein vibes. So... Guys, it's not looking too good for us. Let's go with box number two. Last one. See if we get this uh, Freddy Funko as Pennywise. Oh, these sorters are exponentially difficult to get open. Last one, here it is. All right, we got Whopper from Fantastic Beasts. This is a Funko Shop exclusive. So this is the one where everybody made a huge fuss because this was a Funko Shop exclusive, and then the flocked one was like a um, Kohl's exclusive, and it was so weird. But yeah, people weren't sure why they wouldn't make the flocked one the Funko Shop exclusive. So let's look at values on these and see how we did. Whooper comes in at a whopping seven dollars on the Funko app. The Coma Dwarf with the guitar is a whole six dollars on the Funko app. 
Venomai Spider-Man is at $19 on the Funko app right now. And Mitsuki, the Hot Topic exclusive, is $18 right now on the Funko app. All right, guys, so we got back $50 in value and we spent $60. Not a big deal. Uh, I mean, in all boxes like this where they're 15 bucks and you could hit on a $200 pop and you expect to probably lose some money. So, uh, not too terrible. Shout out to uh, Stop, Pop, and Roll. Uh, make sure you check them out. Grab a mystery box or two from them and support everybody else in the Funko Collector Society by following us at Funko Collector Society on Instagram. Make sure you follow me at Left Coast Pops. Follow me on Twitch at twitch.tv slash leftcoastpops and follow my wife at twitch.tv slash gothposh. Uh, make sure you shoot me a comment down below and let me know how you guys think I did. Uh, which one of these that I'm not into should I be into? And uh, we'll see you guys a little later on this week with another new video. Catch you soon. Peace! Sorters.